were two occasions um, where the Lord actually gave uh, two particular people a set time. One was a young man who was about 22 years old and he used to come to our home. And the name was Leon. And uh, the Lord just said to me, he said, you tell him he's got until tomorrow. That's all he's got. He's got until tomorrow. Uh, he was in the police force. And uh, I said to him, I said, listen here, yeah, this is what the Lord is saying. And I remember him quite clearly saying, he used to call me Uncle Dip. He says, Uncle Dip, you know, I'm young and I'm still having a good time and all that. I said, uh, uh, sorry, his name was Dion, not Leon. I said to him, Dion, listen to what I'm saying to you. Ah, he said, I'm going to Port Shepston tomorrow. And he said, I'm going to meet some buddies. And he said, I'll think about it. Well, on the Saturday afternoon, we got a message that, uh, yeah, he'd met with his buddies and he just bought a new 9 mil and the 9 mil had gone off and uh, the bullet went through him and he was dead. And then while I was uh, at hospital services, I, I, I had a very similar experience and a chap uh, said to me, he said, oh, I said, you, you think because uh, you're involved with the prayer meeting here that you're the only one that's going to go to heaven. I mean, this, this chap was having a, you know, like a real go at me. And there were a couple of other uh, tradesmen uh, with him and they were all chirping and again the, the spirit just said to me he said tell him he's got until tomorrow i said lord you can't do this you know and i said to him i said lapis what you need to know you've only got until tomorrow he said look when i had my turn way back i, I handed out uh, hymn books uh, at the methodist church you know so i said I'm, you, you're not you're not listening to me you've got until tomorrow that's all you make right now and he scoffed and he was a, a, a fisherman, had his own ski boat. He launched the ski boat and somehow or the other he got tossed out and the propeller went through his head and that was him gone. So those were, you know, two experiences that uh, one just doesn't like, you know.